Good morning, it's Pastor Ken. You know, our society is searching for authenticity, something real. And I think the quest for authenticity begins in our own personal lives, our becoming real. And this is how it's done from the Velveteen Rabbit. What's real, asked the rabbit. Real isn't how you're made, said the skin horse. It's a thing that happens to you when a child loves you for a long, long time, not just to play with you, but really loves you, you become real. Does it hurt, asked the rabbit. Sometimes, said the skin horse, for he was always truthful. When you are real, you don't mind being hurt a little. Does it happen all at once, like being wound up or bit by bit? It doesn't happen all at once, said the skin horse. You become it takes a long time. That's why people who break easily usually don't become real. Generally, by the time you're real, most of your hair has been loved off, your eyes drop out, you get loose in the joints, and very, very shabby. But these things don't matter at all, because once you're real, you can't be ugly, except to people who don't understand. You know, I've been privileged to know some very real, shabby, beautiful people who through the years have been perfected in grace, who have gone through the school of hard knocks and have suffered their losses and disappointments and yet have opened their hearts and lives to the grace of God, becoming vulnerable through our hardships and our tragedies and disappointments and even when our lives seem to be blown apart, like many people are experiencing right now. This is where we find our reality, our strength, our beauty. Paul said it in 2 Corinthians, God's power is perfected in our weakness, in our expressed vulnerability. Have a wonderful day. And remember, in the end, everything goes away, even COVID-19, everything but love. Be still and know that I am God.